Passion Travel is a channel specializing in all things travel street food and subscribe if you like brochettes, skewered and grilled meat, typically beef or goat, seasoned with local spices. Brochettes are a popular and flavorful street food in Chad and many other parts of Africa. They consist of skewered and grilled pieces of meat, typically beef, goat, or sometimes chicken. Brochettes are beloved for their smoky and savory flavor, often accompanied by a variety of spicy and tangy sauces. Here's how brochettes are typically prepared and served. Meat selection. The choice of meat for brochettes is crucial. Beef and goat are the most common options, prized for their tenderness and rich flavor. The meat is typically cut into small, bite-sized pieces. Marination. The meat is marinated in a flavorful mixture of spices, herbs, and sometimes a bit of oil. Common ingredients in the marinade include garlic, ginger, chili peppers, salt, black pepper, and local spices, which give the brochettes their distinct taste. Skewering. The marinated meat is threaded onto long skewers, often with vegetables like onions, bell peppers, and tomatoes interspersed for added flavor. Grilling. The skewered meat is then grilled over an open flame or charcoal, slowly turning them to ensure even cooking. This grilling process imparts a smoky and charred flavor to the meat, making it incredibly delicious. Serving. Brochettes are typically served hot and can be accompanied by various side dishes and condiments. Common accompaniments include bread, couscous, or millet, as well as spicy sauces like harissa or a tangy tomato-based sauce. Presentation. Brochettes are often served on the skewers themselves or removed from the skewers and placed on a plate for easy consumption. Brochettes are a popular street food and can also be found at local restaurants and bars throughout Chad and other African countries. They are a favorite among locals and visitors alike, offering a taste of the region's culinary traditions. When enjoying brochettes, be sure to try the different sauces and condiments available to enhance the flavor to your liking. Boule. A type of bread, similar to a round baguette, that's commonly eaten with various stews and sauces. Boule, in Chad typically refers to a type of bread, which is a staple food in the country and many other parts of Africa. It's also known as, French bread, or, baguette, due to its resemblance to the French baguette. However, Chadian boule may have some distinct characteristics and adaptations to local tastes. Here's what you need to know about boule in Chad. Ingredients. Chadian boule is made from basic ingredients, primarily wheat flour, water, salt, and yeast. The flour used is often locally sourced, and some variations might incorporate other grains like millet or sorghum. Preparation. The dough is prepared by mixing the flour, water, yeast, and salt. It is then kneaded until it becomes smooth and elastic. The dough is left to rise until it doubles in size, and it's often shaped into long, narrow loaves. Baking. Traditionally, boule is baked in wood-fired ovens, which can impart a unique flavor and texture. The high heat of the oven produces a crispy crust while keeping the interior soft and airy. Size and shape. The size and shape of Chadian boule can vary. Some are long and thin, similar to French baguettes, while others may be thicker and shorter. The size may depend on the preference of the baker or the region. Usage. Boule is a versatile bread that is used in various ways in Chadian cuisine. It's often served as a side with stews, sauces, and grilled meats. It can also be used to make sandwiches, particularly in urban areas. Cultural significance. Bread, including boule, holds cultural significance in Chad. It is a symbol of hospitality and is an essential part of many meals and gatherings. Availability. Boule is widely available throughout Chad, both in urban and rural areas. Local bakeries and street vendors often sell freshly baked boule daily. Variations. Depending on the region, you may find some regional variations of boule, which could incorporate different grains, spices, or other ingredients to give it a unique local flavor. When visiting Chad, trying boule is a must to experience the country's culinary culture. Whether you enjoy it with a hearty stew or as part of a sandwich, you'll appreciate the simplicity and taste of this essential Chadian bread. Bulbaula. A Chadian specialty made from millet couscous, served with various sauces and toppings. Bulbaula, also known as bulblu, or bulbulu, is a popular Chadian dish made from millet couscous. It's a staple food in Chad and is enjoyed by many Chadians as part of their daily diet. Bulbaula is known for its simplicity, versatility, and satisfying flavor. Here's how it's typically prepared. Ingredients. Millet. Millet grains are the primary ingredient used to make bulbaula. 
Millet is a nutritious and drought-resistant grain widely grown in Africa. Preparation. Cleaning and washing. Millet grains are cleaned and washed thoroughly to remove any impurities. Steaming. The cleaned millet is then steamed in a large, specialized pot known as a couscousier. This pot has two sections, with the upper section containing the millet and the lower section holding boiling water. The steam from the boiling water cooks the millet in the upper section. This steaming process allows the millet to become fluffy and tender. Fluffing. After steaming, the millet is removed from the pot and fluffed with a fork or utensil to separate the grains and create a light and airy texture. Serving. Bolbaula is typically served hot and can be accompanied by various side dishes or sauces. It is often served with a sauce or stew made from ingredients such as tomatoes, onions, and sometimes meat or fish. Some people also enjoy it with yogurt or milk. Variations. Bolbaula can have regional variations and may incorporate different ingredients and flavors depending on the local cuisine and preferences. In some variations, spices like ginger, garlic, or red pepper may be added to enhance the flavor. The choice of sauce or stew to accompany bolbaula can vary widely. Common options include a tomato-based sauce, okra sauce, or peanut sauce. Bolbaula is a simple yet hearty dish that provides sustenance and comfort for many Chadians. It is an important part of Chadian culture and is often shared with family and guests as a sign of hospitality. When visiting Chad, trying bolbaula is a great way to experience the country's culinary traditions and connect with its people. Moussaka not to be confused with the Mediterranean dish of the same name, Chadian moussaka is a casserole made with aubergines, eggplants, ground meat, and spices. Moussaka is a popular dish in Mediterranean and Middle Eastern cuisine, but it has variations in different countries, including Chad. The Chadian version of moussaka is quite distinct from the well-known Greek or Middle Eastern moussaka. Here's what you can expect from Chadian moussaka. Ingredients. Aubergines, eggplants, the key ingredient is aubergines, which are sliced and usually fried until tender. Ground meat. Typically, Chadian moussaka includes ground meat, such as beef or goat meat. Tomatoes. Chopped or crushed tomatoes are used to create a tomato-based sauce. Onions and peppers. Onions and bell peppers are commonly used for flavor and texture. Spices. A variety of spices and herbs, such as garlic, ginger, and hot peppers, are used to season the dish. Oil. Cooking oil, often palm oil or vegetable oil, is used for frying and sautéing. Preparation. Slicing and frying aubergines. The aubergines are sliced into rounds and fried until they become tender and slightly golden. This step is essential as it gives the dish its characteristic texture and flavor. Sautéing meat and vegetables. Ground meat, onions, bell peppers, and spices are sautéed until the meat is browned, and the vegetables become soft. Layering. In a baking dish or pan, a layer of fried aubergines is placed at the bottom. Then, the sautéed meat and vegetable mixture is spread on top of the aubergines. Tomato sauce. A tomato-based sauce, often seasoned with additional spices and herbs, is poured over the meat and vegetable layer. Baking. The moussaka is baked in the oven until it's cooked through, and the flavors meld together. The top may become slightly browned and crispy. Chadian moussaka is known for its rich, savory flavors and the contrast between the creamy, tender aubergines and the flavorful meat and tomato sauce. It's a comforting and hearty dish that is enjoyed by many in Chad. While Chadian moussaka shares its name with the famous Greek moussaka, the two dishes are quite different in terms of ingredients and preparation. It's a great example of how a dish can have variations and adaptations in different culinary traditions. Chad Sandwich a local sandwich made with a baguette filled with various ingredients like grilled meat, vegetables, and condiments. A Chad sandwich typically refers to a sandwich made and served in Chad, a landlocked country in Central Africa. These sandwiches are a popular street food and can vary in ingredients and flavors based on regional preferences and the availability of ingredients. Here's an overview of what you might find in a Chad sandwich. Bread. The choice of bread can vary but it's often a baguette or French-style bread. These bread types are readily available in many parts of Chad. Fillings. Grilled meat. Grilled meat is a common filling for Chad sandwiches. It can be beef, goat, chicken, or even fish, depending on what's available locally. The meat is typically seasoned with spices and grilled to perfection. Vegetables. Chad sandwiches often include fresh vegetables like lettuce, tomatoes, onions, and sometimes bell peppers. 
These veggies add crunch and freshness to the sandwich. Sauces. Various sauces and condiments are used to enhance the flavor of Chad sandwiches. Common options include mayonnaise, ketchup, mustard, hot sauces, and a variety of local chili sauces or salsas. Fried egg. Some Chad sandwiches feature a fried egg as an extra protein source and added richness. Cheese. Depending on the region and availability, you may find cheese as an optional ingredient. Spices and herbs. Local spices and herbs may be added for extra flavor, such as black pepper, garlic, or herbs like parsley or cilantro. Customization. What makes Chad sandwiches unique is the ability to customize them to your taste. You can often choose your preferred type of meat, vegetables, and sauces, allowing for a personalized sandwich experience. Chad sandwiches are a convenient and satisfying street food option that can be enjoyed on the go or as a quick meal. They are widely available from street vendors and small eateries throughout the country, and their ingredients can vary based on local preferences and what's in season. When ordering a Chad sandwich, feel free to ask for your preferred ingredients and condiments to create a sandwich that suits your taste buds. It's a great way to experience the local flavors and culture of Chad.